winter scent. So lately uh, I've been over here staying at my new place where I live now and uh, where I've been living pretty much off and on for about three years but uh, now it's official I'm permanently living here you know I'm, I haven't been over to my mom's house in a couple months uh, to live there or anything but I know that she always tells me I always have a home there so you know that's really kind of, of my mom she's just a very special lady I will always love her and, and she's very loving and caring about everybody and uh, you know she's getting older now but she's very beautiful still and my dad he's kicking ass he's working for uber anyways that's a whole nother story that's it's in what this whole video is about but uh i got a laptop cooling pad it's a it's a clem clem wind blue and yeah i'm pretty excited about it it's an unboxing i'm gonna go ahead and start let's see where I can set my phone here there you go there's a good spot all right and we're going to unbox this motherfucker I am it opens right up it is, it's very slim, slimmer than I thought. The foam makes it look thicker. Check it out, the foam here, bubble wrap, whatever. And the USB that we need. You open it, there you go. There's your cooling pad. Very thin, lightweight, pretty lightweight. A little bit heavier than I expected, but it's it's lightweight now. It's easy to pick up. It's not a pain in the ass to drag around, you know what I mean? So got some uh, notes or special things, instructions and whatnot from Clay. I'll turn this bad boy on. See what happens. In a second, that's the, see what's new with this. I've never had one of these, and uh, I assume that it's really going to help the uh, heat dissipation. The laptop, so, so I'm always gaming on my Acer Predator through the OS 300, it's right here. But I'm playing Doom Eternal, so I want, you know, and Black Desert Online and stuff like that, so it really kicks my uh, laptop's ass, so I really need to make it. I mean, the cooling is great on the laptop. Don't get me wrong, it's lasted me some months now, and no problems, but I just want to be safe. Better be safe than sorry, and uh, yeah. check this bitch out right now. Left side. Yeah, yeah. It doesn't matter. Plug it. I'll go to the right side. Thank you, bad boy. To the impact. Nice and cool, very nice and cool. So what I want to do is just pick up my laptop. This should be interesting. Let's see how interesting it gets for gaming. Should be better off because I like 
this angle. I'm gonna go ahead and pop them. Pop open this. This quick guide out and read it in Dutch, English. Okay. Place the cooler on a flat surface. Lift the rear feet and frontal support tabs, which I did. Place your laptop on the cooler. Connect the USB cable to both devices. Use the dials to activate each set of fans. And actually, I don't have to use the dials because they're already on. Each set of fans is already on. So, let's see how good this works. This is a nice little device here. An accessory here. I'm going to scoot it back a bit. Yeah, yeah this works. Anyways. Looks like my FPS is uh, right where it needs to be. About 70 FPS in Doom Eternal. Ultra settings. Probably gonna die because this is a really hard part of the game. This is, I know, can't see it or anything, but damn, this is the, like the hardest part of the fucking game. It's the coldest base, um, the mancubus part. Uh, you start out right here, the mancubus fucking jumps out right there, starts shooting you. You're getting shot. You're getting shot. You're getting. You got it fucking. Yeah, it gets crazy, man. So, cheers, Doom Eternal. 10 out of 10. So far, I've been through quite a few chapters. I'm gonna continue. I'm gonna try to beat this fucking manky this part. And I gotta do something about this unibrow that's forming already and shit. And I gotta shave, shit, and shower. Alright, later.